we were all charmed by those photos of Thomas Markle, father of royal bride Meghan Markle, reading up on Great Britain in anticipation of his daughter's royal wedding to Prince Harry. But now those same photos are one of the reasons why Thomas didn't attend his daughter's nuptials today. After the press learned those photos were staged, Thomas announced he would skip the wedding to avoid further embarrassment for the royal family and his famous daughter. He then underwent surgery following an unexpected heart attack, which contributed to his decision to stay back even more. So who walked Meghan Markle down the aisle on Saturday, May 19? Prince Charles was the one who walked Meghan down the aisle, and she looked so happy when he took her arm and passed her off to his son Harry at the altar. However, he didn't walk her down the aisle the entire way. Meghan, 36, started the walk by herself with her adorable bridal party of children behind her. She then met Charles halfway through. See the photos below. Photo credit, Getty Images, photo credit, Getty Images, photo credit, Getty Images, Kensington Palace previously announced on Friday, May 18, that Meghan asked Charles to take her dad's place with this tradition. Ms. Markle has asked His Royal Highness the Prince of Wales to accompany her down the aisle of the Choir of Street. George's Chapel on her wedding day. The Prince of Wales is pleased to be able to welcome Ms. Markle to the royal family in this way, the statement said at the time. An update on the number royal wedding pic. Twitter.com WFJ6 Fizzy, Kensington Palace, at Kensington Royal, May 18, 2018. How sweet is it that she asked her soon to be father in law? According to People, it was Meghan's choice to ask Charles, even though it had to be so last minute. It was Meghan's wish, and she is grateful for the Prince of Wales to be doing it, a royal source shared with the news outlet. Many royal fans thought the brother of the groom, Prince William, would be walking by Meghan's side, since he has spent more time with her than Charles has. However, some were also thinking that Doria Ragland, Meghan's mother, would do the duty, especially because Doria is particularly close with her daughter. Photo credit, Getty Images, Thomas's actions, unfortunately, left Meghan and Harry with mere days with which to find a replacement. Just after the news of Thomas's deal with a photo agency broke on May 14, he told TMZ he wouldn't be going to the wedding. He said he agreed to the deal in an effort to restore his reputation after paparazzi captured photos of him in unflattering circumstances. But now he deeply regrets posing for the photos, which he said look stupid and hammy. And that was just the beginning of the drama. The 73 year old soon dealt with a string of health issues that put him in the hospital just days before the nuptials. If Meghan's mom, Doria, would have been the one to walk her down the aisle, the suit star would have been the first royal bride to be accompanied by her mother. In 1966, Queen Victoria walked her third daughter Princess Helena down the aisle when she married Prince Christian of Schleswig-Holstein five years after the death of the bride's father Prince Albert. Queen Victoria also had the honor again when her youngest princess Beatrice tied the knot with Prince Henry of Battenberg in 1885. The royal wedding was even more amazing with the future King of England on Meghan's side. What really made their aisle walk though? Meghan's stunning wedding dress. Join our Facebook group for the latest updates on Kate Middleton, Prince William, and all things royal. More on the royal wedding Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's first kiss after their royal wedding was magical, see the pics. Meghan Markle is wearing Queen Mary's sapphire band o tiara on her royal wedding day The first photos of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle at their royal wedding are here. Pippa Middleton seemingly debuts a tiny baby bump at Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's royal wedding Kate Middleton looks gorgeous at Harry and Meghan's royal wedding weeks after giving birth beard or no beard. See which look Prince Harry chose for the big day. Queen Elizabeth attends royal wedding after giving Prince Harry and Meghan Markle permission to marry Prince George and Princess Charlotte stole the show at the royal wedding, see the pics. Meghan Markle's mom Doria couldn't help but tear up watching her daughter marry Prince Harry Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's royal wedding carriage ride was the perfect photo op.